Hi, my name is Saman Kumar, Program Manager for Manufacturing at IFS Research and Development. In this video, I'll be showing how to use IFS Manufacturing Visual Planning to resolve material demands for the shop orders planned to start in next two weeks. In Visual Shop Orders Planning page, I use one of my saved queries to open shop orders planned to start within next two weeks. Then I visualize them. I can see some material problems in the Material Availability Summary chart. First, I close the machine and labor availability summaries as I have already resolved them. Then I set material lines availability chart to filter from material availability summary chart. Then I click shortage to populate all the materials having shortages to material lines availability chart. The chart is set to color by part. There are four parts and nine material lines. I change the color by to availability category. Three material lines are short and shown in red color, others in the state of need orders. I include existing requisitions as supplies that can resolve five material lines that need orders. Today is 29th. Material lines with shortages are required on 30th, 31st in this month and 4th in next month. I change the date to latest order date. That shows me material should have been ordered more than a week back, 20th and 24th. This explains why the lines are short. They are required within the lead time. Then I reset the time back to the required date. How to resolve these shortages? I open anti-corrosive additive part card and check the details and then I decide I can delay this order till the material is available. So I use update TSD according to material availability. The scheduling direction and the earliest start date will be changed for the order and I accept the notifications. Order is rescheduled to a later date according to the material availability. The shortage is now gone and then I attend to my next shortage part with the shield additive. I also notice that there are some alternate components that I can use to replace the existing major component. The advantage is the order will not be rescheduled but the material will be replaced by an alternate component. For the last material line with shortages, the card shows me the latest order date is in the past. But I will create a supply order, a purchase order and send to the supplier. Probably I can discuss with him and expedite it. And get the material before the production to run the production smoothly. This resolves all my shortages. To resolve material lines in need order state, I select the section in the material summary chart and the lines are populated in the material lines availability chart. I create a supply shop order for my Earl Grey material line by using the card. I can see that the status of the line changes to supply covers demand. Similarly, for all the other material lines, I can create supplies manually and fulfill them. Once I create supplies for all the material lines with the state need order and resolve all the material requirements, I check the entire demand supply profile of few material lines as they are critical for the production. For that, I use inventory part availability planning chart, which is set to filter by material availability summary chart. First, I select supply covers demand in material availability summary. I want to check distilled water part and I search for it and check the demand supply profile, the projected on hand development, and the planable quantities. Then, I search for the part lemon flavor, which is also critical for production. And I want to change the receipt date of one of the supplies. I open the card and then select the option reschedule. Move the receipt dates two days earlier and then click OK. I can see that the order is now planned two days earlier. 
Now all the material requirements are resolved for next two weeks production. And also there are no machine or labor overloads as I have already resolved them in earlier IFS Insider video. Verify labor and machine loads before releasing shop orders using manufacturing visual planning. Now I can select all the shop orders and release them for production and expect a smooth production run for next two weeks. Thank you for watching. Please do not forget to subscribe to IFS YouTube channel.